First thing first, I want to thank Psycho for Pizza. She got me DayZ, guys. She did it. If it came down to me getting this myself, I was going to get it, but it had to been around, like, probably after Christmas that I'd been able to afford it. She got it for me, guys. Like, I'm so excited. I've been playing it a little. She's been playing it a little. It's been amazing. I'm loving this game. I really am. I just want to know. If you guys want to see some DayZ content on this channel, let me know. And everything's been just going so well. I'm enjoying life right now at a max my shots been on even though it's probably about to be off this game because uh if you guys pay attention there's a level 138 guy on an enemy team everything's well though um make sure you guys go and follow me on instagram i'm at 11k and um yeah i'm trying to get to 15k out here you know what i'm saying guys okay okay bring it bring it tomorrow guys the newest update is coming out tomorrow think about this guys think about this the update is coming out tomorrow we're gonna see if we're actually getting hijacked if we're getting whatever we're getting we're gonna see what we're getting tomorrow and just amazing in my opinion stuff that's about to come to the game multiplayer updates blackout updates zombie updates we're about to get so much content tomorrow even dlc one that i probably won't get when it first comes out unless it has the ballista or dsr like as a dlc weapons i don't know if they're gonna bring dlc weapons dlc weapons was never really a thing the only game i think had dlc weapons was like what was it ghost it had a dlc sniper and no one really cared about that sniper neither because low-key it was like overpowered and it was kind of easy to get kills with it new specialists a lot of new things guys um if you guys like fortnite i say give it a chance i say give it a chance boys and girls the reason i say that though and i'm not trying to say oh because it's better than fortnite but i mean they're doing a whole like the map idea you can tell they got a little of the idea probably from Fortnite, even though i don't know what they're about to do because this is about to be the first big battle royale update for call of duty ever but I can tell that things are happening on a map, like actual events are about to be happening on a map. Something that really don't happen unless it's Fortnite. I don't think there was any other Battle Royale game that did that. They got that idea from other games. I'm not going to name the other games, but, you know, they started in a Battle Royale. They may have taken the idea from something, but, you know, they kind of started it for the Battle Royale. So you got to give Fortnite that props. And that right there is leading Call of Duty to, like, a specific, uh... I don't want to say it's it's like giving them the idea, but it's probably leading them on. You know what I mean? It's not completely handing them the idea because, of course, they're going to go and do some Call of Duty stuff. They're not going to add building to the game, but doing something well. It's just about to be amazing. I'm excited. Like, this year has been very sad, very annoying, but the end of this year, man, it's like it feels like it's about to be a great way to start off 2019, honestly. But yeah, don't forget to go follow me on Instagram if you guys aren't already. I'll put my at in the description. Don't worry if you guys don't know. It's going to be down below. But yeah, guys. Uh, I hope to see you guys tomorrow. Tell me if you guys want some DayZ content. Tomorrow's video is going to be on that update. I hope. It depends what time the update come out. So just be ready.